If you want to have fresh, homegrown vegetables all year round, the best and easiest way is to build a proper raised vegetable garden bed using treated timber. Because at Home Timber and Hardware, we reckon if it's worth doing, it's worth doing properly. First, you'll need a nice flat patch of dirt that gets plenty of sunshine. Depending on the area you've got available, you'll need to choose your lengths of timber to suit the space. We recommend using 200mm by 50mm by 2.4m treated pine sleepers. Because they're resistant to rotting, they also look great. Check your local stores for availability and alternative options. An ideal size is 1.2 metres wide by 2.4 metres long and two sleepers high. Of course you can go longer if you've got room. You'll also need four corner posts of 90 by 90 millimetre treated pine pots. It's recommended working with timber to always wear safety equipment including gloves, dust mask and goggles. Start by cutting your short end sleepers to size. Mark and drill your screw holes. Then attach them to the corner posts using 175mm galvanised coach bolts and washers. Next, attach the long sleepers to the two end sections and bingo, you've got a proper raised vegetable garden bed frame. Before you put the soil in, it's a really good idea to line the bottom with a weed mat which prevents weeds growing up from underneath, whilst also allowing excess water to drain through. Use a stapler or a hammer and carpet tax to attach it to the sides of the frame. Now you're ready for the soil and fertiliser. A well draining garden soil is recommended. And by mixing organic animal manure and homemade compost through, you'll help create a proper environment for growing fabulous fresh vegetables. For further advice on soil quality, extra fertilisers and what to plant when, drop into Home Timber and Hardware anytime or to download a handy brochure on the proper way to build a raised timber vegetable garden, click on the button below. Your local home timber and hardware. The proper hardware store.